morning. We're out to, uh, about to set sail, uh, sail on the yacht here. Most people in Israel, you know, uh, or most lakes have a nice sweet boat. We like our sweetly imported uh, dinghy up here. Uh, we, like, we like to keep it simple. I have to have a life preserver, so here's my end. Uh, here's yours. James, this one's for you, okay? So I <laughs> So we are on the shore of the Sea of Galilee, the southern part of the Sea of Galilee. Uh, it's a perfect day to go in the lake. Uh, preferably not get dumped over into the lake, um, but to float on the lake. Not walk on the lake, but ride on the lake in the boat. In the wind and the waves. <laughs> the one who calms the raging storm. The one who walks upon the sea. Earth and heaven are your own. So, our gas motor did not start. And as you can see, these waves are pretty big <laughs> straight ahead. Uh, but we're surviving so far. Is your name? Because there is none like you. There is none like you. Together we proclaim. Now it's a peninsula because um, the water is, is getting very, very low on the Kinevet, on the Sea of Galilee this time of year. And um, we had some of our biggest rainfalls we've seen in a long time over the last week or so. So thank God. So hopefully, hopefully the island will disappear and the water will rise greatly. At our congregation yesterday, we were praying for rain and that um, although Israel is is at the, uh, at the head of the game on desalinization and bringing water in from the, from the sea. Um, we, want, we want rain. We want rain. We want this, this lake to be full. And uh, we pray for, as the Bible calls it, the latter rains, which has a beautiful spiritual reference as well. Man, you, it's funny. You get on this lake and all of a sudden you just feel like a holy man. You're like, <laughs> so many holy things have happened here. There is none like you There is none like you Together we proclaim The power of your name There is none like you How majestic How majestic is your name How majestic is your name how majestic is your name in all the earth? How majestic is your name? Sing how majestic is your name. There's the cameraman. Jimmy. Mr. James. Look, no hands. <laughs> There's Mr. Ryan. Uh, I called the guys and I thought, it's a great morning, it's Shabbat. What a nice relaxing time. And as we're out on the lake, you know, you can't help but just just remember the things that happen in, in, in the days of Yeshua in the Bible times. This lake can go from 
glassy flat to wavy and coming up over into the boat. It's winter right now, as a matter of fact. If you notice, it's all green around us because winter is not what it snows. Maybe uh, on Mount Hermon in the north, but in, in the land of Israel, in the winter is when it rains. So we've got a lot of great rains. The water hasn't risen yet. It's a good sign that the water on the lake will rise. But what happens is it's beautifully green everywhere. Just remembering that uh, the one who calms the raging storms is the one who uh, is in control and has a hold of our, of our lives. And even though we might be crazy and take a boat out and take <laughs> venture off to where we shouldn't go, uh, he brought us back home safe. <laughs> Wishing uh, peace on all of you guys. Uh, wherever you're at as well.